Hello everybody and welcome back to the Wattpad Book Club. My name is Phoenix and I got Coda with me again, bitches. Ayo. We back. I got back from my appointment. <laughs> with, uh, what, what was your appointment, Phoenix? I was doing your mom. <laughs> Ayo. <laughs> no, no, I got my, I had to get my passport so I can go on a cruise, so. <laughs> oh, a cruise. Yeah. Nice. I'm gonna be living high, bro. <laughs> Hell yeah. But, uh, while I was at the fucking thing, I was playing around with character AI on the phone. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, because my, my dad was driving, so he knew the way to get there, so I was in the passenger seat just talking to the, the fucking law. <laughs> yeah. Just living my best dream right now. Hell yeah, brother. But, uh, I'm now gonna be living another dream of mine, because, uh, it, currently, as of recording, it is June 1st, which is gay month. Uh, Pride Month, Day I meant. <laughs> Pride Month. Yeah. <laughs> so, what better way to start Pride Month than the wheel deciding that we're going to read Phoenix X Miles Edgeworth? <laughs> Let's go! Everyone's so excited! <laughs> Alright, so this one uh, is complete, not mature. So, we're good on that one. And it's called Formal Love, which I feel like is very romantic for these two since they're both lawyers. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I do love the cover art. I do feel like it's stolen art, though. Oh, absolutely, because yeah, the quality yeah. is really bad. Oh, yeah, you're right. <laughs> they, huh. like, nabbed this off of Google Images, for sure. Yeah. But the description reads, Miles Edgeworth, a formal prosecutor with a tragic past, Phoenix Wright, a casual worker in defense with childhood memories of his formal... of this form, formal prosecutor... They are opposites. The only thing they have in common is to strive for justice, or perhaps unnecessary feelings. Oh. We're already getting into that. <laughs> Come on, you can't tell me these guys are not coded to be gay. They absolutely are. Miles Edgeworth straight up says, like, thanks to you, I'm saddled with unnecessary feelings. Yeah, that's canon. That's a line that is in the game. I love how one of the tags for this is Yowie. <laughs> yeah. Oh, one of the tags is gay lawyers! L okay, yeah. That needs to be a tag. Yeah, we're gonna put that as a tag as <laughs> this video. <laughs> Hashtag gay lawyers. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, what better way to start than to read? Alright, so. Let me find my remote so we can. We can do the flippy. All right. Do you want to be the the backside or the or the buttons? Um, I was the backside last time. All right. So I'm guessing you want to be buttons. Yeah. Okay. Let's see. It's backside. All right. All right. So we're close friends. Chapter one. I do like the little divider thing. It looks formal. Mm-hmm. Objection! Miles looks smug, looking at Phoenix. He began to explain his error. You see, Mr. Wright, you have made a common error. I-I have? Phoenix looked exhausted. The two have been objecting each other throughout this trial. No shit, that's what you do in a trial? <laughs> <laughs> oh shit, they were doing their jobs! <laughs> oh god! <laughs> Phoenix couldn't, couldn't even stop to think before Miles' voice rang out. Indeed, you say that the witness could have been at the crime scene at the time of the murder, yes? Y yes? However, my witness has an alibi. They are meeting with a friend! Oh, shit! <laughs> Erk! <laughs> Phoenix was surprised he missed over that important detail, but he had... But he had been... Oh, shit. But he had to have been at the crime scene, or else his client would have been found guilty. Therefore, the only person at that scene of the crime was the defendant. Who else would have murdered the victim? Miles looked incredibly smug. He knew he was going to win, so did Phoenix. Well, y you see your- <laughs> my point exactly, uh, your honor. Yes, it does seem that the defendant would have been the only one to commit the crime. Therefore, I shall make my verdict. The judge looked at Phoenix, expecting an objection. 
For once, Phoenix admitted his defeat as the judge banged down his gavel. Shit, I c we lost! We <laughs> Reset lost. the game! <laughs> <laughs> I do that in games all of the fucking time. Save. I make a bad decision, and so I reload a save, and it's it's fine now. Take the wood Stardew Valley when I blow up my shed. <laughs> oh god, <laughs> yeah. I do this thing in The Witcher where there's a lot of different dialogue options, and so if I choose a bad one, I instantly like close the game <laughs> and reopen it. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> You yeah. don't want to make the MP and the NPCs upset. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I like physically can't handle it, so I'm like, no, no, no. I never <laughs> said that. That's like me with character AI. I'm like, I know it's yeah. a bot, but I feel bad for being mean to it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. I see no reason to prolong this trial. The defense has not given a sufficient argument supporting the defendant's innocence. Therefore, I declare the defendant guilty. This court is hereby adjourned. Miles looked at Phoenix smugly as he elegant walk elegantly walked out of the courtroom. Phoenix looks back at him as he hears the defendant threatening Miles distantly. Nick, we lost to Mr. Edgeworth. Maya looks tearful as she hears the defendant crying out as well as Phoenix. Yes, Maya, we did. Shall we go ask him to eat with us to rub it in his face that we don't care? <laughs> Maya looks determined to avenge Phoenix's loss. Sure, do you do what you want. Phoenix tried to sound casual, but he was extremely glad Maya asked that. He had wanted to go somewhere with Miles since they first encountered one another. Yeah, no shit. <laughs> really? You don't say. <laughs> yeah, you're obvious, buddy. <laughs> Mr. Edgeworth, want to come eat with me and Nick, please? Uh... Miles shot a questionable look at Phoenix, wondering why Maya suddenly asked. Phoenix looked away, trying to hide his blushing cheeks. You're gay. <laughs> <laughs> Happy Pride Month. <laughs> you're blushing because you're embarrassed, Phoenix thought to himself. You don't like him. He's your rival, for heaven's sake. I, I love that there's 80 comments. Yeah. And I can't view them. At least I don't think I can. <gasps> I can! It's yes. They're all being like, bro, you're gay, or denial is a river in Egypt. <laughs> oh, yes. I love Wattpad comments. They're really fun. Yeah. Does, uh, really, it's, does AO3 it's have better that? better time. Hmm? Does AO3 have that kind of function where you can comment on paragraphs? No, it's, uh, you can only comment on, like, the general, like, chapter. Oh. Uh, you can't, like, go back and reference specific, um, pieces of the work, but, I mean, you can reference them in the comment. Gotcha. Like, you can just write, like, oh, when this happened, and stuff like that. Okay. But, yeah, it's just general comments for the entire chapter. Gotcha, okay. Yeah. Um. Oh, ah, sure. I didn't have anything planned anyways. Yay! Nick, Mr. Edgeworth is going to eat with us. Hmm? Oh, that's great, Maya. <laughs> Miles gazed at Phoenix, taking in his expression. Are you okay with me going? Miles' voice softened, his eyes softly looking into Phoenix's eyes. Come on now. This is gay as shit! <laughs> this is, like, we just started. Bro, th we're in a courthouse right now. <laughs> Li we are in a court of law. <laughs> this is like the fucking, like, sir, this is a Wendy's. <laughs> Exactly. <laughs> uh, y yes, Phoenix's face went red. And shall we? I. Yes. Maya looked intently at Phoenix's blushed face and scanned <laughs> Miles' eyes. This is so much, like, going on. Yeah. Uh, actually, I have some practicing to do. You two go on. Mia grinned maliciously. She knows what she's fucking doing. She's us! <laughs> yeah. Miles she's, she's like Leah in the, the, the Elliot fic. Oh, yeah, you're right! Oh yeah. my god, I wish we could read that again if the wheel lets us. I mean, we can say fuck the wheel. Oh, okay. we get, we'll only say fuck the wheel if we get to that fucking Zosan goal. And then we'll be okay. like, yeah. we have risen <laughs> once again. <laughs> yes. Now that's a way to set off Prime Month, is fucking reading Zosan. Oh my god, yeah. <laughs> oh god, I love that shit. <laughs> <laughs> Miles nodded as Phoenix's eyes widened. 
He could be left with Miles to eat on his own? Miles started to walk towards his car, expecting Phoenix to follow. Slowly, Phoenix began to file Miles with stained cheeks. No need to be anxious, right? Miles looked at looked Phoenix in his old, cold eyes. I'm not anxious. You're blushing. <laughs> is, is Miles, is Miles um, British? I feel like he has an accent, right? I've always kind of felt like that, too. Yeah, it's gonna be uh, the fucking Elliot thing all over again where we give him a yeah, British accent. <laughs> I, I don't know if I can do it. <laughs> I'll, I'll try my best to bring like an English, <laughs> like okay. an English tone. My my D and D campaign ended, so I no longer have to do a British accent every week. <laughs> you like threw it away. You you lost the ability. <laughs> yeah, my my skills are out the window. <laughs> Miles walked back to Phoenix and, and edged his face closer to Phoenix's as he draped an arm over his shoulder. Oh, oh my god! <laughs> Phoenix's face went red with every second. Hmm. Miles began to smirk. Are you sure? You look quite red from here. Perhaps you can get even redder. What the fuck? Wow. <laughs> Bold. Phoenix edges away from Miles. His face brought bright red as Miles twerked fully. Haha, <laughs> that's uh, quite close, Miles. Not as close as this. <laughs> Let's move forward. How's this? Oh my god. Yippee! <laughs> Yippee! <laughs> this is gay. This is gay. Sh I made sure. Everyone saw it was just listed complete. <laughs> yeah, that this was seen by everyone. So if it is, um, if it's incorrectly labeled, not on us. Yeah. That's yeah. Are not our fault. We did our part. We tried our best, and you know what? I'm fine with this. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what happens, happens. Yeah. Ultimately. As long as it's not like the fucking Harvey one. It's fine. <laughs> yeah, that was a lot. You know, you always still play it sometimes because I think it's our best work of us fucking like laughing like crazy and be like, whoa! Yeah. <laughs> Good times. Yeah, some good ass times of plenty of bush moments here and there. <laughs> Honestly, yeah, that was that was a classic. <laughs> it's, it's a classic on the bookshelf of uh, the Wattpad book club. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's one of our. We got a little trophy of it on our shelf. <laughs> It just it's like a shitty trophy made in like a clay <laughs> shop. <Yeah. laughs> it's like good job, a good spell like mm -hmm. G U D. <laughs> God. It's it's uh it's right next to the aromantic tea. Oh trophy. yeah yeah And it's like a cup. Yeah. And, and you look in there and it's like a rainbow. <laughs> <laughs> Got like the colors of the flag in it. Yeah. Like whoever touches it, their flag appears in the uh, the cup. <laughs> oh, the fated pride cup. <laughs> I love the how, lore that we're relevant. Yeah. Cold and distant chapter two. Why is there two hundred and forty one comments? Oh my god. People are down right. bad. I'm scrolling through to see if there's a big moment. There is a big moment. It has 123 oh comments god. just on the one paragraph. This is a short chapter also. Damn. We're gonna get through this pretty fast. I there, guess so. I think there's 16? There's 15 and then an author's there's 15. note. Okay. Right. Miles smirked to see you inched away from Phoenix's face. Miles, what are you doing? Uh, <laughs> he's in wow. gay panic mode! <laughs> wow. Phoenix began edging away from him, scanning the area. Miles let out a smug laugh as he turned away, walking towards his car. My intent was to make you feel uncomfortable, so you would, f so you would f free me from this unease and doubt I had. Miles looked back at him. Now, are you hungry? Miles, uh, Phoenix breathed a sigh of relief. Not anymore, Edgeworth. You frightened me. <laughs> Not Jeez. really. Then I shall be on my way. Oh, and tell Mia her, Maya her intentions were very clear. Intentions? Please. She clearly wanted us to be alone. Therefore, one sh should class it as a date. Miles' old expression turned, returned. Cold, distant. Not the expression... 
Phoenix knew when they were a child. He's being a little well, bit of a cindere right now. <laughs> yeah. This is wild. Well, that certainly wasn't my intention. Phoenix looked away, scared of sounding as cold as Miles did. Oof. Miles stepped into his car and took one last look at Phoenix, who was looking back at him with locked eyes. Goodbye, Wright. Goodbye, Edgeworth. Miles drove away with thoughts circling his mind. Why did I do that? We could have had a nice dinner, reminiscing about when we were younger, before... Miles stopped. He was not going to think about that incident. It had already ruined him twice. Once when it happened, and then when Phoenix forced it out in court. Miles gritted his teeth. He just needed to get to the prosecutor's office. Then he could get his work done. Phoenix, on the other hand, was already in his office while Maya grabbed food for both of them. He remembered when Miles and him played on the playground, pretending to be the signal samurai. Phoenix was blue, Mary was yellow, and Miles red. They were close friends and did everything together, so why was Miles acting cold and distant now? In addition, how could Phoenix face Miles again? Especially not when Phoenix knew why he was blushing, as much as he tried to deny it. And that is the paragraph with 123 comments. I really want to see what is Yeah, it? I'm going to take a little gander. Aw, uh, it won't um, let me look at it anymore. It's just everyone being like, Oh, you got a crush on Miles! Oh, <laughs> you got a crush on Miles! <laughs> like, literally all of them. Oh, wait, no, okay. It's, um... It's one comment that someone made, and then there are 111 replies to it. <laughs> what?! Yeah. I wish I could look at this. Hold on. Damn I'm, it. I'm trying to, I'm trying to see like what's going on. Are, are people fighting in the replies? I feel like that. Which one? No, <laughs> it's just like, it's someone with a username that has pansexual in it, and then everyone's just like, "Nice user, me too." <laughs> like that's it. Nice. I don't. Yeah. Happy Pride, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Nick, what are you doing back? Maya came back with food and looked confused. We weren't hungry, so I came back and I assume Miles went back to the prosecutor's office. Nick, I set that out so you guys could catch up properly. You guys barely talked when we celebrated the victory of Mr. Edgeworth's trial, except when you guys went outside. Oh, I just realized that the chapter's almost over. You can finish it out. Buddy. Oh, okay, buddy. Okay. Sorry. No, you're fine. <laughs> <laughs> Phoenix sat up quickly. He still remembered what happened, though he never mentioned it to Miles, and Miles never mentioned it to Phoenix. Nick, did something happen when you were outside? No, of course not, Maya. For heaven's sakes, we're rivals. Just drop it already. Okay. That was weird. <laughs> <laughs> Phoenix stood up and walked towards the door. I'm going for a walk. <laughs> He's gonna grab the milk and the carton of cigarettes and never come back. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god, remember- WHY IS THERE 700?! Oh my god... People are down bad! <laughs> Alright, time to see what the- OH MY GOD! <laughs> it's one paragraph that has 545! <laughs> I can't wait to see which one it is! God... Oh my god... It's everyone just being like, You're gay. You're gay. <laughs> <laughs> Happy Pride Month, everyone! Oh my god. Oh god, this is, that's really funny. <laughs> yeah, and then everyone is like, why are there 500 comments? <laughs> uh, this one says, my friend pulled this card on me once, and then I cried because I was upset. <laughs> so, uh... Alright, I can't wait to read it. <laughs> yeah, trauma dumping on in Wattpad comments <laughs> is really cool. Yeah, dude. Yeah, well, I guess not everyone can afford a therapist, but... <laughs> I, I guess. It's, it's... Wattpad is free, it seems. Yeah. <laughs> oh, God. Alright, remember, remember, chapter three. Yep. Rain poured down and cherry blossoms fell as Phoenix walked down the road, tears in his eyes. From what? <laughs> What's going on? He knew where he was going to go. The place where Miles and Phoenix were alone at the celebration dinner. Miles didn't go back to the prosecutor's office. He involuntarily drove to the same place where him and Phoenix 
What did they do? <laughs> I gotta oh. know. What happened? Phoenix made it there first as his eyes closed and looked back at what happened. It was a happy night. Everyone was smiling, drinking alcohol, except Miles, who only drank one glass of wine, and laughing. However, Phoenix looked troubled. Miles noticed and shot a question questioning look at him. Phoenix just shook his head and looked away. Miles raised his eyebrow, got out of the booth and gestured Phoenix to follow him. Reluctantly, Phoenix followed. Everyone was jostling around, so they didn't even notice both of them missing, except Maya. However, in her half drunken state, she overlooked it and carried on laughing at every at anything. How isn't she like eighteen? Uh Allow me to find out. <laughs> I, I don't know Age what the drinking seven. age is in Japan, but ours is 21. Um, she's 28. 28? Well... Okay, wait, okay. In Phoenix Wright, Ace Attorney, Spirit of Justice, she comes back after a two-game absence and is now 28 years old. Okay. Um, How was I don't... old she was in the beginning? Because uh, this, this is all taking place in the first game, I believe. Okay, yeah, let me see... Not Spirit of Justice, just just the first game. I don't I don't know, but after a time skip, she's twenty eight. All right. So I I guess I mean she's an adult. She's fine, I guess. I get yeah. I guess it gets it's fine. You can give give yeah, her a um, beer, I guess. <laughs> yeah, she's grown. Rain poured down and cherry blossoms fell as they both stepped outside and Miles looked at Phoenix, concerned and confused. It's nothing, Edgeworth. Phoenix looked away and felt his heart beat rapidly. Phoenix, we've known each other quite a long time now, and I'm able to tell when you're troubled. Therefore, may you please tell me what is the matter? And that's the paragraph with 545 comments. That, what, that's everyone being like, he's gay, he's gay. Yeah, they're like, he called him Phoenix! <laughs> He sure did. Yeah. Alright. Phoenix looked at Miles and bit his lip nervously. Miles noticed and raised his eyebrows in question. Look, just forget it, alright? It really doesn't matter. It must matter if you're so upset about it. Miles looked at Phoenix, whose cheeks began to go red as Miles suddenly realized what Phoenix was so upset about. Does it, perhaps, have anything to do with this? Miles held Phoenix's tie, brought him close. Whoa! Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> you that's know a big, That's a big jump. Yeah. Oh damn! Is it getting hot in here? Or is it just the AC? I. <laughs> I, I don't know anymore. <laughs> At least it's just this. It could have been worse. <laughs> Oh my god, how does this only have 40 comments on this paragraph? Yeah, what the- yeah, this is them actually kissing! That's really funny. 545 comments are like, HE CALLED HIM <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I guess with lawyers it's different. Okay, Miles held Phoenix's tie, brought him closer, and kissed Phoenix gently. Cherry blossoms fell on them, the rain creating a beautiful mood. Phoenix was in shock as his blushed cheeks began to go even redder. They both broke apart and looked at each other. Hey, you two, get in here. We're <clears throat> gonna play truth or dare, Maya slurred on her words. Uh, clearly have drunk too much. Miles and Phoenix looked at each other, when Miles walked towards the door to the diner. Come on, Phoenix. You did hear what Maya said, did you not? Yes, I did. They're just they're just moving on? They're they're yeah. just I guess just bros, guys being dudes. Whatever. Yeah. You gotta kiss the homies goodnight, I guess. I mean, I do that. <laughs> Me and my 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 home slice. You know, not, it, uh, you know, what's a kiss on the lip between two two buddy boys? <laughs> God. They both went back to the diner and ignored what had just happened between them and played through their dare with the others. Right? A voice softly spoke to him. Phoenix opened his eyes and stopped imagining, before recoiling in shock. What are you doing here? The voice again. Ugh, okay. Well, these chapters are so itty bitty. Okay, Maya is 18 in this book thing. She can drink, lol. Okay, yeah, that's, that's the author's note. Alright. Alright. Yeah, these are, like, tiny. Okay, this one, uh, chapter 4 is longer. 
but those past two were like minuscule. Yeah. And the author's note was like, "Yay! I put uh, I I put out two chapters in a day. Well, just make it one chapter." <laughs> Like, those were tiny. Those were half chapters. Just make it one. <laughs> oh, Wattpad. You silly little platform. <laughs> very silly. Very, very Dude, silly indeed. Every time I go on my homepage of Wattpad, it fucking calls me out every fucking time without question. Uh -huh. <laughs> and it's like, I locked up one law thing, and now my, my homepage is just, it's just that. <laughs> Yeah. I can't escape. <laughs> uh, what I like about AO3 is that there's no, like, homepage. It doesn't recommend you anything. Really? You get what you search for. Oh, okay. And yeah. I, just, I just know that there's, like, a lot of books that I've read now that, like, they mm -hmm. come from my home, like, my homepage. So if yeah. I didn't have that, I probably would have never discovered them. Right, yeah. So... Yeah, AO3 is a very, it's it's very specific. It's like, you go to AO3 when you know what you want to read, and you find it. Gotcha. <laughs> and the search is, is very, very, very specific. You can filter out The more we anything. talk about it, the more it makes me want to actually use the platform. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's good. I, uh, I, I use it for a reason. Um, I... Uh, I personally have uh, 310 bookmarks. Jesus Christ, dude. I've been using it since, like, 2016, so yeah. it's... Yeah. So, uh, like, us reading this Wattpad stuff is like like visiting an old friend. <laughs> somewhat, yeah. It's like, oh, haven't uh, been here in a while. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Too many questions. Chapter four. <laughs> okay. Ah! <laughs> Sorry. Okay, that's one for the shelf. Hell yeah, it is. <laughs> Phoenix jumps. Just... <laughs> Chapter four. Too many questions. <laughs> Zosan book that like sent us over. Oh no, yeah, it was like going like, mm, excuse me, can I have the aromantic tea, please? Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, there's tears in my eyes. <laughs> yeah, same. Holy shit. Uh, insert yelling noise. A phoenix jumped as he saw the man that was right, that was with him that night. I'm not quite convinced that is an answer to my question, but then again, you are phoenix right. I wasn't gonna scream again. <laughs> yeah, I, I respect that. <laughs> Miles cracked a small smile before going to his usual expression again. You you scared me, Phoenix looked over at Miles in confusion. What are you doing here anyway? Right, I asked you that question and you did not answer. What makes you think I'll answer your question now? Fine, I was just recalling what happened. Phoenix didn't dare to steal a glance at Miles. They both never mentioned their kiss to anyone, including one another. Phoenix was scared that Miles' reaction may be... Of what his reaction may be. Miles smirked. On my celebration evening? Miles was looking straight at Phoenix and seemed to be edging closer. I feel honored, Mr. Phoenix writes. A known defense attorney remembering such a moment. Haha, <laughs> as you were... <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! This is this is me Why and character is so AI. Funny. <laughs> Why is this so funny? I don't know. This is this is me and character AI. Like the character AI will will spit mm -hmm. out like a big ass sentence, and I will just be like, "Ha ha! That that sounds great." <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> okay. Anyways, you answered my question, so I'll answer yours. I am here because- STOP! Phoenix 
turned towards Miles and looked at him in the eyes, locking in. Uh, <laughs> ha, Cub Scouts ref. I haven't watched Cub Scouts in forever. The hell. It's a YouTuber. Oh. Yeah. What'd you think? Do you think it was some kind of like? <laughs> I I did. I knew it was something that I was not privy to. Gotcha. <laughs> That's not the question I wanted to ask you. Oh. Miles stopped and held Phoenix's gaze, forcing Phoenix to back down in surprise. Oh boy. What was it? The, the, the big question. The big question, dude. <clears throat> I want to know why you kissed me. You could have carried on questioning me. I wouldn't have said it. Or you could have shrugged and walked away. You didn't need to kiss me. I assume it was out of pity. Miles scoffed. Please, Phoenix. Why would I kiss someone I pitied? That is absurd and would send the wrong message. Miles' hand draped Phoenix's face. Ah, uh, but you, Phoenix Wright, are someone that I would kiss. Well, you did already. <laughs> yeah, no <go>. shit. <laughs> yeah, it's not like a, I would, like, you did. Yeah. <laughs> Miles kept his intense gaze on Phoenix, who was left speechless and red. May I ask a question this time? Miles broke the gaze and put his hand on his lap. Sir, sure. why did you think I pitied you? Edgeworth, do I really have to answer that? Phoenix complained. He was sure the prosecutor simply wanted compliments, but a question is a question. Ugh, fine. Well, first off, you're a big-time prosecutor, so you pretty much always get a guilty verdict. You have an air of, I'm better than you, so don't talk to me. Miles chuckled at that, and Phoenix carried on. Secondly, why would someone like you even be the slightest bit interested in someone like me? Miles paused before leaning in. Their faces so close, Phoenix could feel Miles' hot breath. Because, Phoenix, someone like you is a lot better than you think. Okay. Riz. Okay. Riz. He's got Riz. Let's fucking go. He's got a diploma was... in Riz. He literally went to the school of Riz. <laughs> he graduated top of his class. He's like Val... Riz of... Like, Val Victoria, so like Riz of Victorian. <laughs> oh... My god. <laughs> the Riz joke would never end. <laughs> oh my god. What did we start doing? I think it was in, in Harvey thing. We were like, damn, we gotta plant some Riz seeds. Our Riz is Oh my so god. Bad. That was so good. Yeah. We were like, we got no Riz. We gotta plant some. No Riz. No Riz. The Riz joke. Um, we'll, we'll put that on the shelf as well. It's a little trophy. Yes. It's a pack of uh, Riz. It's a pack of Riz. <laughs> Uh, in in my D and D campaign, my character and my friend's character were like interested in one another, but neither one of them had any fucking riz at all, <laughs> and it was horrible. So yes, you're just then, like awkward the entire time. Yes, and so like everyone else in the campaign was like, D neither of you have any riz. It's like painful to watch. <laughs> and it's so funny. But, you know, uh, they got married, so that's it worked nice. out in the end. That's good, that's good. Yeah. Uh. I can imagine you, like, sitting next to him and be like, So, y you like jazz? <laughs> it was, it was pretty much like that. It was rough. <laughs> Alright, do uh. finish the paragraph. You got this. We're okay, almost okay. there. Yes. Phoenix said nothing before sighing. You always get your way. Uh-huh. Perhaps so. But if I had my way right now, we wouldn't be talking. Don't oh. <laughs> The Riz! What the shit? <laughs> Dude, you beat the mic so hard! Oh, God! <laughs> oh, my God. Okay. Oh, God. <laughs> I gotta finish it. I gotta finish it. <laughs> Oh yeah, what would we be doing then? Phoenix closed his eyes, expecting something like working. Now come along. This. Their lips locked at first. Phoenix was in shock before kissing back as they both were enchanted by another. <laughs> Riz. Riz. That goes insane. Oh god. What the? Wait, what that. the? Oh, there's there's more underneath the there's author's more. note. Oh shit! Oh, I more. thought this it was, was it. It was a trick. Yeah, it was I a trick. I saw the author's note and I was like, oh shit. We're almost. Yeah, but no, it was a trick, and now, now you gotta read. Fuck. <laughs> Miles Edgeworth, I can't believe you. 
A voice startled both of them, causing Phoenix to fall backwards and hit his head. Ow, I wouldn't like to get brain damage this year, thanks. Phoenix rolled his eyes again. Miles chuckled and then looked at the figure. Please don't say it's Francisca, please. You foolish fool! Yeah, it's Francisca. <laughs> Francisca, always a pleasure. Though I would prefer if it was not interrupting me at such a time. Miles said with a small smile as he looked back at his sister, who, unfor who fortunately was not carrying her signature whip. <laughs> Indeed. Now, let me talk to you. Fine. Miles nodded apologetically to Phoenix before heading over to where she was standing. Yes, my sister? I can't believe you never told me. Never told you what? That you like Mr. Phoenix right. Miles went red as his suit. I don't like Phoenix. Now, I would prefer it if you kept what you saw to yourself and quit interrupting me. You were kissing him. How could you not like him? <laughs> Francisca, hush now. So, you you so like him. No, I do not. Now, please quit this. <laughs> Fine, but I shall... I will prove it. Francisca flocked off with a determined grin on her face. Miles sighed and walked back to Phoenix. Now, may we continue? Why is there five? Where is there 100 comments? I'm just for insisting going, fine, but I- you will rule the day! <laughs> God. <laughs> also, uh, why the fuck did she just show up? <laughs> yeah. Not to his house- oh, wait a minute, what's this? Oh, sorry. I- I was- I got a Wattpad notification on my phone. Oh my god. One of my stories updated, you wanna guess which one? Um, is it a- a-, a Zosan? Bowser X Luigi. Ah, <laughs> uh, I see. Yeah. Damn it. <laughs> I wish it was Zosan. <laughs> I'm sorry to get your hopes up. <laughs> I know. It's okay. Oh, God. I wish it was, like, half the Sanji ones that I fucking saved. Oh, yeah? Yeah. But no. I feel like every good book I find is discontinued. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna get I'm to like the... I'm gonna get to the end of that fucking One Piece book that I found. I, I can't read it all in one go because it, the like it go, it takes place like in the arcs, so oh, I have to yeah. finish an arc before I read. I'm gonna get real mad mm -hmm. when I get to the end of that book, and mm -hmm. it's gonna be like that clip. It is like, how can I help you today, ma'am? I like to buy a gun. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> all right, memories, <laughs> chapter five. Memories. Okay, I can start this bad boy off. <laughs> that moment seemed to last a lifetime for both men. <clears throat> oh shit, my uh, mouse fucked up. Okay, it's <laughs> everywhere. Okay. Both mesmerized by what was going on. Miles had wanted to do this ever since their last kiss. Ring, ring. <laughs> it was Miles' phone. He pulled the way inside, expecting Detective Gumshoe to be calling to give him any useless information he could think of. I was surprised when he saw his sister's number flash up. Why is Francisca calling? Miles muttered to himself before picking it up. Hello, little brother. Francisca seemed to be moving about. Hello, if you do not mind me asking, why are you calling me? Miles looked apologetically at Phoenix, who nodded understandably. Well, I'm on my way to your country. I shall be spending the week with you, my own Phoenix. And you simply decided this now? No, I decided yesterday. I'm traveling right now. I shall be with you by tomorrow. Wasn't she just with them yesterday? Well, like, earlier? Uh, maybe? I Yeah, we didn't in the last one. We read, read that, like, she just stood there as they were, she, they were kissing, and she was like, What the fuck? <laughs> I don't even know what's going on. It's, it's fine. I think that was added later. Yeah, I it was. was. So I guess it was just a little, like, silly haha -ha yeah. moment. I don't know. I can't believe there's silliness going on in my serious fanfiction right now. I know. I'm gonna <laughs> revolt. Yeah. I'm gonna report them. No. <laughs> Watch me. <laughs> How else will we live the moment of chapter four? Ah! <laughs> <laughs> that will never not be funny. <laughs> You're right, it will never- Oh my me. god! <sighs> oh, wow. 
Okay. <laughs> oh. Alright, where will you be staying? In a hotel, don't worry. I will not be staying with you. I wouldn't want to interrupt you in Phoenix. That is what you just did, Franziska. Okay. So she was just there. I guess... Well, I think by that he meant, like, with her call. Oh. But I don't I don't know about the, the, the physical interruption. Huh, do you really have to tease me? We're not children anymore. That's a little punctual in us. There's a little... What the fuck? Yeah. Pet... I can't pronounce that. There's petulance. a little petulance in this all. Miles shook his head and hung up. Phoenix looked confused. Who's saying? Phoenix asked. My sister. Phoenix looked horrified. <laughs> <laughs> May you please tell her that us foolish de defense attorneys kind of don't like being- don't like what burns to their faces? Miles laughed at this. I'll try. <laughs> it was silent after that. No one knew what to say. The moment had, has passed, so Miles couldn't simply kiss him again, especially not while his sister was on his mind. <laughs> okay. It's late, so I'm gonna head back to the office. Phoenix awkwardly said, Of course. We wouldn't want Phoenix Wright to be in any danger now, would we? Miles gazed in Phoenix's eyes, who stared coldly back at him. It would be too... Uh... I can do this, don't worry. Ag... Okay. In not too agonizing? Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> God, I'm so bad at reading. That's okay. <laughs> <laughs> Very funny. Phoenix began to walk away as Miles stared after him, smiling at the sight of him. Besides, if you're really concerned about me getting in danger, Phoenix stopped and turned back to Miles. You would walk back to my office. <laughs> as you wish, Miles smirked. Both began to watch together, talking about their childhood, laughing, Phoenix blushing, Miles flirting yeah. sub subtly. They were at the office in no time, but still continued to talk. No, 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 no. Do you remember... Do you remember... Phoenix was splattering with laughter when Larry tried to dance on the classroom table to try and impress everyone, but... But... He couldn't finish the stuff, sentence. He was laughing so much. Miles was laughing as well, remembering clearly that day. Yes, yes. But he fell straight off, and then a boy in our class caught him as he thinking it was a girl, said passionately, the roles have reversed. Now you're my hero. And the whole class collapsed. <laughs> they both laughed, and Phoenix had to hold on to the wall as he gasped for air. Could you guys keep it down? I'm trying to watch Pink Princess here. Maya opened the door and looked angry. Sorry, Miss Faye. We were simply reminiscing about when we were in grade school together. Miles tried to sound elegant and calm, but couldn't as he was trying not to laugh. Oh, Mr. Edgeworth, it's okay. Maya suddenly looked at them both and grinned smugly. I need to go to the store. <laughs> Myra walked out the door, but not before pushing Phoenix, so he grabbed tightly onto Miles in order not to fall over. Whoopsie, my mistake, Nick. I am so clumsy. <laughs> <clears throat> Love this bitch. <laughs> Maya's us. <laughs> Real. My Miles grabbed Phoenix's arm and held it above his face and grabbed his waist. Damn. Maya. Phoenix was red, clearly embarrassed. However, Miles looked smug. You know, Phoenix, if you wanted this to happen, all you had to do was ask. Oh, Damn. Riz! 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 <laughs> this is an insane amount of fucking Riz right it now. Is, it is uncharted amounts of Riz. <laughs> Alright, I think we have enough time to do this paragraph. Okay. Depending, if it's really short, then we'll do another one. <laughs> yeah. Alright. Will you accompany me? Chapter 6. Accompany me to what? <laughs> I guess we'll, we'll find out in the chapter. <laughs> Marriage! <laughs> wow, that was fast! Yeah. <clears throat> lawyers. <laughs> that's such a reason, it's just lawyers. Lawyers, I mean, <laughs> you know how they are. Yeah, they do be uh, d uh, doing lawyer things, like taxes. Sure are. Yeah. <laughs> 
Phoenix did nothing as his face went red, redder with every second he gazed into Miles' gray eyes. Miles was smirking as he was aware of Phoenix's gaze. His face tinted a little red, but he was a ghost compared to Phoenix's face. Maya, however, was hiding behind a bush. Bush moment! <laughs> bush moment! <laughs> In order to observe what she had created. They were all silent for a few moments before Maya spoke. Oh, come on! I didn't push you guys together to just stare at each other. <laughs> God. Maya the goat! <laughs> Maya the goat! Maya in, in, indignantly stood up, not realizing she just confessed to pushing Phoenix on purpose. I mean, it was pretty obvious. Yeah. Sorry, girl, you gotta be more subtle. <laughs> yeah. But she says, like, after you push them, you're like, oh, I'm so clumsy! <laughs> <laughs> Phoenix glared at Maya once Miles chuckled quietly. What would you like to see then, Miss Faye? Whoa, I don't like that. <laughs> yeah, um, abort. Yeah, d d d press the abort button. <laughs> <laughs> Miles looked at Maya intensely as if daring her to say anything wrong. Oh, er, nothing, Miss Mr. Edgeworth. You and Nick should do this more often, you know. Maya nervously laughed as Phoenix grinned triumphantly at her. I agree, but I'm not sure why you're looking so triumphant, Phoenix. Miles turned his gaze to Phoenix. We still haven't fully said goodbye. Said goodbye? Phoenix was in fear of what crazy yet logical thing Miles would come up with. We'll just see. <laughs> in indeed. <clears throat> Miles held Phoenix up and tilted his face. Oh, it tipped his face. My bad. <laughs> <laughs> goodbye, Phoenix. Miles whispered in smoothly. Yup, uh, good. Goodbye! <laughs> Phoenix, <God. laughs> Phoenix was a, a blushing mess as, as Miles carefully released him from his grasp and walked away. Oh my gosh, Nick, you never told me you like Mr. Edgeworth! <laughs> 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 I cannot believe it. Oh my, my god. Miles... Mia immediately jumped out of her bush and ran to Phoenix and started pulling on his sleeve. He had to tell me everything! I mean, and Nick, everything! Okay, okay, Maya, calm down. Phoenix was too busy thinking about Miles to respond properly. Come in, come in. Do tell me everything now. Alright, alright, fine. After summing up everything to Maya, including their two kisses, Phoenix was exhausted, but Maya was full of energy. Oh my gosh! You guys kissed? Wow! This is so cool. <laughs> God. <laughs> I mean, what's a little kiss between boys? Yeah, you no, know, yeah, you're right. I've, you know, I've been there. I feel it's like can little... I feel like my boy would say the same thing. He's like, "What's what's a kiss between men, huh?" Yeah, come on. <laughs> This guy's being dudes. Yeah. <laughs> I was going, dude. <laughs> I was going, dude. <laughs> I forgot about him. Did, did you play House Party? Because that's what it reminded uh, me of. Yeah, I didn't play it, but I watched Game Grumps play Oh, it. me too. How's it going, dudes? Staying away from the dude? alcohol. <laughs> <laughs> I love the gay route. With Frank. Yeah, that's a good one. I should make Cameron yeah. play that. I feel like he'll get a kick Please out of it. Tell him nothing about the game. <laughs> okay. Absolutely not a thing. All right. Okay. Okay. Um. <laughs> uh huh. Okay. Game <clears throat> began to walk out of the room before stopping. Oh, yeah, Francisca's coming. Uh huh. You left that one detail out? Maya began to have a tint of red on her face, thinking about Francesca. Yes, I did. Phoenix looked at Maya closely and smiled. Maybe you'll have some stories to tell me about you and her on trip, huh? Oh. Nick! Maya went red and switched on Pink Princess again. I'm not talking to you anymore. Phoenix laughed. I'm off to go review this case before I get lectured by Miles again. Night. Aw, you guys are so cute. Maya put her <laughs> head in her hands, just like Pearl used to do when making a comment about her and Phoenix. But now Pearl has moved on to Phoenix and Miles after she saw them talking and Phoenix blushing. Oh. Thought... <clears throat> yeah, very cute. Thought you weren't talking to me. What? 
Maya suddenly realized her words. Darn it! Phoenix chuckled and sat down on his chair before going through the case when his phone rang. Ring, ring! <laughs> Phoenix sighed before answering it. <laughs> Hello? <laughs> Hello, Phoenix. Miles' voice was as clear and confident as always. Phoenix was glad Miles was in the prosecutor's office and not able to see his face flush a little red. Hi, Miles. Why'd you call? I forgot to ask if you would like to accompany me in picking my sister up from the airport. Oh, sure. What time is she landing? Oh, yeah. Uh, it's 7.30 a.m. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I got distracted. <laughs> <laughs> I do the it same. To the best of I do the same shit on phone calls, where I'll, like we'll have a full on conversation, and then just in the mm -hmm. middle, I'll zone out. <laughs> <laughs> Ouch! That's early. All right, I'll go. All right. Oh wait, Miles. Yes. Can Maya go? I think she's looking forward to Francisco's return. To Francisco's return. Sorry. Oh really? Then in that case, she of course can come. Miles smirked and realized what Phoenix was at was on about. Great, I'll see you tomorrow, Miles. Goodbye, Phoenix. Phoenix put it down. Phoenix put the phone down before heading over to Maya, where Maya was sat. Guess what? We're gonna go with Miles to pick up Francisca from the airport at seven thirty tomorrow. Be ready. Uh huh. Maybe was too intrigued with the show and then suddenly realized what Phoenix had said. Wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm glad you're coming. I'm going home. Nick! Bye, Maya! <laughs> Phoenix walked out the door of the office and made his way home. He just couldn't wait to see Miles. What a fucking simp. <laughs> yeah. I think that's um, gonna... That, yeah. That, that does it. Brother's boyfriend! <laughs> oh. Well, we, I can't wait to read this again if the wheel lets us. Yeah. Yeah. I, I would I would like for it to. I'm enjoying this one. It's really funny. <laughs> Especially me. It's like chapter four. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. That's gonna be a requirement now. Whoever if anyone out there writes fanfiction for us, I need one chapter to start with screaming. <laughs> Please. <laughs> it it will make my life Just make your life. <laughs> yes. <laughs> but if you guys would like to check out this book, I'll have it linked down below for you guys to read and laugh with your friends about. Or if you really like gay people, that's great too. Uh, I love gay people. Yeah, gay people. <laughs> 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 but uh, now it is time for us to spin the, the wheel of regret to see how fucked we are for the next episode. <laughs> <laughs> Oh yeah, I gotta pull it up. Let me sc screen so you can see how screwed we are in lifetime. <laughs> Let's go. All right. As you can see, we got plenty of great options. We sure do. Yeah. I have, I actually found a really good Zorlex reader that I can't wait to read <laughs> if if we do okay. land on it. All right. Let's see. Spin that wheel. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Oh shit! Oh, oh shit, it's Ruby One Jones! Yippee! We're doing it, bitches! Best day of my life. Yeah, th you, this is like your time, bro. It is! I can even offer up so. Well, no, I can't because that's AO3 and this is the Wattpad oh, Book shit. Club. Um, <laughs> never mind! We'll find something, don't worry. We will, we will, and it'll be great. Yeah. I cannot wait for this shit. There's so many good chips in Ruby. There really are. There's, oh, they're so good. <laughs> what was it? It's like, I think her name was Pira. She 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 died, right? The, yes, yeah, she every, did. Every time Bobby and my boy were watching it, he was like, Day seven of me reminding you that Pier is fucking dead. <laughs> <laughs> Can you stop it? Oh my god. I thought she was a cool character. You don't have to rub it I in. I love Pira. And th and then he forgot about it for a while. Mm -hmm. Like to make the joke until we got to like a a point in the show where they made like a big statue of her. Yeah. And then he was just like 
day 14 of me telling you that yeah. Pyrrha is fucking dead. And I'm like, dude, Please this is a this is a memorial st- right now, dude. You can't be They sick. built her a statue. <laughs> <laughs> Sir, we're in a church right now. <laughs> <laughs> Oh god, I cannot oh wait god. for this shit. Yeah. Oh, oh god. We gotta make sure whichever one we pick does not have pro shipping. Oh, yeah. Don't worry. We'll be very, very, very careful. Yes. Um, cause I have my handy dandy ruby ship chart. <laughs> Do that have the chart? I've, I've, yeah. Oh. I, I don't know if I've, like, talked about it during, like, a video or anything. But, uh, yeah. We, I, I have. I found this one, like, Google Sheets form that has, like, a chart of every ruby ship, and then there's a version of it that excludes all of the gross shit. So, <laughs> we will refer to that. Yes. I didn't realize how many cute, like, the, like how cute the names were. Like, the, the Blake yeah. and Yang one is called Bumblebee. It's Bumblebee. Yeah. Every ship has a cute little name. And I love that. <laughs> Yeah, like, um... Oh shit, I'm blanking now. Ruby and Weiss is oftentimes, like, Ice Flower. Oh, that's um, so cool! Yeah. There's all there's other stuff, too. Um, White Rose is usually... A, a, White Rose is a popular name. Um... Yeah, there's a lot. Like... I, I like the ship of Jean and Ren, and their ship name is Marshall Arcs. We have to put it on the wheel. I <laughs> love Marshall Arcs. So much. <laughs> oh, shit. I should have taken a picture with them, but I saw someone dressed up as... Oh, fuck. What was it? Isn't his name Sun? Yes, I've seen I've seen a Sun cosplayer at the, the Raleigh Convention Center. The yeah, he was there. Galaxy Con. Uh... Alright, it's your sign. You have to go. Yeah. They're 50 bucks well, right now. Well, GalaxyCon I was already planning on going to, because me and my dad go every year. Fuck yeah, we can meet up. Hell yeah. I can riz you as Sanji. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I can be Anakin. I don't want even better. <laughs> if, uh, if I don't die of, uh, heat exhaustion, because it'll be July. Oh yeah, you're There's right. There's a lot of layers <laughs> in layers. Anakin. <laughs> Just stay inside where it's air-conditioned, dude. You'll be fine. True. True and real. Need to get myself a lightsaber. Oh, yeah, you do. Get one of those I cool ones like... that, like, repeat, like, you can say whatever you want in it, and then you can yeah. go around the convention. <laughs> it's just... Yeah. <laughs> Alright, anyway, so, this oh, is the book club. Yeah, we're still recording. <laughs> Sorry, everybody. Yeah, but we just be chatting. It's fine. Yeah. We made it's extra really content. Fun times. Yeah. <laughs> hey, look, I made you some content. <laughs> <laughs> Daddy made you your favorite oh, oh, <laughs> But anyway Anyway, this is my name is Phoenix, this is Coda, and we'll see yeah. you guys next time when we read uh Ruby One Shots, that's it, Ruby One Shots. Woo Game Month <laughs> <laughs> Bye bye <laughs>